Hi, Namaste. My name is Niri Sankar, 14 years old from class 9, representing Reliance English Secondary School, located in Miklausing 7, Madhubala, Morna. Today, I'm going to give a speech on space and entrepreneurship. Space entrepreneurship refers to the growing involvement of private companies and entrepreneurs in space-related activities. This field has expanded significantly in recent years, driven by advancement in technology and a shift in space exploration from government-dominated efforts to a more commercialized industry. The concept of space entrepreneurship can be tracked back to several individuals who played a significant role in advancing the idea of commercializing space. One of the early pioneers is Mr. Dennis Wingo, an entrepreneur and space advocate who co-founded Skycrop Incorporate in 1997 with the goal of developing commercial activities in space. The concept of space entrepreneurship was first introduced by Mr. Peter Diamond Dees, a former CEO and co-founder of Zero Gravity Corporation. He has a lot of ideas in this field, such as space mining, space tourism, planetary defense, space, space colonization, and innovation in space transportation. Space entrepreneurship has numerous merits, including driving innovation and technological advancement in space exploration, satellite technology, and resource utilization. It fosters competition, potentially reducing cost for space access and exploration. Moreover, it stimulates economic growth by creating high-tech jobs and generating revenue through satellite services and asteroid mining. However, space entrepreneurship also comes with demerits, such as lack of regulations, high cost and risk, space debris, and impact on space exploration. Balancing these merits and demerits is crucial for the responsible development of space entrepreneurship sector. Now, for the conclusion, I would like to say that space entrepreneurship is a new concept of business that offers numerous opportunities but in the context of Nepal, Nepal is still in the early stages of developing its own space entrepreneurship sector. The country has shown some interest in space related activities including the launch of its first satellite Nepal Sat 1 in 2019. However, the space entrepreneurship ecosystem is not as developed as in some other countries. As I mentioned, it demerits that space entrepreneurship to launch this entrepreneur, we need financial economic background, which our country being a developing country is not possible for now, but in the future, it may be. Thank you.